Good morning everyone. Today is uh, Wednesday, 26th of April 2023 and the time is 8 a.m. Today I'm going to take you through um, the Robahai Tunnel, the second tunnel ever built across uh, underneath Thames, uh, the River Thames. Then we're going to go through Bourbonsy and then on to Old Kent Road and then back through the city. It's a cold day today, 5 degrees Celsius. And Wednesday is one of the busiest days of the week now. Large volumes of traffic at this time in the morning. This is the A13. The main trunk road leading uh, into central London from the east. There on the left is um, Canary Wharf, the second financial centre of London. Judging by the amount of security in Canary Wharf, it's probably just as important or more important than the city itself, which is the old financial capital in the heart of London. We're about um, two miles now from central London. So between here and the old financial centre is two miles. Two miles, about three kilometres.
mention the city and ahead of us are the, we can see the skyscrapers there that's the city the old city So, we're about to enter the Volvo Hive Tunnel now. After they built and uh, opened the Blackwall Tunnel in 1897, in uh, 1904, they decided to, to start building this tunnel. And uh, within four years, they completed and opened in 1908. It's amazing how quickly they, they could build a tunnel like this in such a short time in, in that time of uh, early days and it was designed for foot, uh, for pedestrians and for horse and cart now you see uh, bicycles, people walking and uh, there's a lot of cars going through the air today so the ventilation is not um, adequate and so the air in here is really polluted I don't know how many cigarettes is, uh, is equivalent to but you're walking down here I'm sure you will be uh, you'll be equivalent to smoking maybe a pack of cigarettes. <laughs> yeah, it's really polluted. They've restricted the width of that vehicles uh, coming through here can be now, so you you can't drive a large van through here anymore. Uh, uh, but before that, there used to be uh, many uh, collisions here, especially with car mirrors. So you drive down here and you see car mirrors on, on the road, broken glass all the time. But now not so much, now that they restricted the width. I don't know if it's very true or not, but um, you can see the tunnel is not straight and um, you go through sections of straight sections and uh, they said that um, the reason why they designed it this way is because they didn't want the horses to start bolting through the tunnel when they see the light at the other end of the tunnel and that's the fear um, don't know what much of that is true or not however if you do get into a black cab and you ask them why they'll probably say this believing it's true I'm not so sure so the other end of um, Brother High Tunnel is the is um, Bermondsey. 
So as soon as we exit, we'll be in Bermondsey. A long time ago, one of the main trades of London was um, import and export. Many goods and, uh, and services were carried along the river, river, the Great River Thames. And uh, Bermondsey was one of those places where lots of um, warehouses and um, and ports were available for boats to offload the goods, the exports and their imports. So there was a, a, a large uh, number of workers living nearby. And this was what happening most of the mostly as economy around here. But when the uh, financial district came in and London became a more important financial area, that those trade along the river, River Thames, they uh, diminished. And in the 50s and 60s this this area here became really poor. They became slums. Still not much better today. But uh, that's the history of this, this area. That if I had continued along the road, we would have uh, reached Tower Bridge. But now we turn here back in the back of Bermondsey. We're going to head to now Old Kent Road. But this whole area is, is still Bermondsey.
kids going to school at this time. On the left there looks like a, a local school. That's called an, an allotment For a very low sum of money you can rent a small patch of of ground there and grow your own vegetables And on the right too uh, You can see onions there Spring onions. be quite careful here because of the kids On the right looks like an industrial area full of uh, car repair and warehouse and companies. So ahead of us on the the road going across is Oaken Road. That's an uh, ice cream van. Now we're on Old Kent Road. The first road on Mon Monopoly. Old Kent Road. This road is uh, extremely busy all the time. I would not recommend going here through here if you want to go into central London. It takes forever. This road is actually 2,000 years old. Uh, the Germans, uh, sorry, not Germans, <laughs> could have been. Uh, the, uh, the Romans, they, uh, they started part of this road 2,000 years ago. And it was intentional was to a carriageway for traffic going in from the south of London in uh, south uh, that's in the south coast into London.
there's quite a large uh, population of Vietnamese here. So as you can see there, there is a um, bar and Vietnamese food. Drip Guan. Used to be an old pub. But now it turned into an eating place. Every time we go down this road, it feels uh, it's quite um, makes you quite happy because it's really busy. Loads of people from all over the world, very multicultural, uh, multicultural area, and uh, it's a bit chaotic as well. And it feels a bit like the Wild West. <laughs> These places where it's uh, great changes that happen. Uh, it feels good. Change is good, and when you see it, it makes you happy. the shard over there that's uh, London Bridge where that is so we're heading at the moment towards Waterloo at this point I don't know where I'm going These are bar these are bicycles you can rent. They're making it harder every day for us to drive and more expensive. But they make it easier for us to ride bicycles. So what does that mean to you? One day we'll be all riding bicycles if they want wanted it their way. Strange, isn't it? progress I be very careful to go through this on time
on the left, on the left is the Southwark Blackfriars, on the right is London Bridge. Which way? Let's go left, guys. Oh, so busy. Power station. So the funny wobbly building up there is near where Waterloo is. So we're head towards there, we should be at Waterloo. Can't go on bicycles. We're now at the South Bank and uh, heading over a bridge uh, to north, uh, north of the river. So I hope you enjoy this ride toward the south. There's the uh, St Paul's uh, Cathedral on the left and there's the city on the right and trains going to Cannon Street Station Yeah, hope you enjoyed this ride and um, hope you can come visit again so please click like and subscribe to my channel Thanks, thanks everyone, see you next time.